business is people. Because if you can't understand people, or at least communicate with people, then you're going to be in trouble. Now, it doesn't mean you all have to be Bill Clinton, you all don't have to be a psychotherapist, but you have to understand how people operate and at least get on with them in some form for some period of time. I've found from my own training work that people can get better at understanding the impact they're making on other people. You can learn this stuff, and all the people who are good at it worked hard at it. They've become aware of what works and what to avoid. We all hate it. If it's called networking, it feels unreal. So listen, give them good eye contact, look at the other person, and treat it as an opportunity to learn something about the other person, about the world. Many, many organizations don't take this seriously enough. Many do. They spend a lot of time and money helping people who are good at their job to become better at these so-called soft skills, which are harder than many hard skills. There are a lot of leaders who are very good at creating rapport. There are a lot of leaders who are rather bad at it. And my thoughts are that we should all get a bit better at it. It certainly helps in a leadership position. You can never stop learning about this, so I encourage people, practice it. Practice it, try it over, try it with neighbors, try it with work colleagues, try it in networking situations and spot people who are good at it and copy them.